Alright guys, now I'm back. I was able to get that fixed real quickly. Sorry about that. Let's continue. On to the next day. Which is the 17th. Yay! One nervous system plays a role with sh when shedding tears. Hmm. Sympathetic uh, system, parasympathetic uh, system, or all of the above. So, that is all of the above. Which one is? Uh, which word is the... <laughs> yeah. In the sentence, Mr. Kondo is such a great English teacher. Ooh. That would be... C. Teacher. Next day! 18th. Yay! How much cost? How much does it cost to produce a one yen coin? Two yen. Louis XIV is also known as the Cruel Duke, the Sun King, King of Soul, sorry, that's Brooke, or the Wing King, Wing King. Sun King. Man, these midterms so much fun. Falling isn't a kigo or spring. Lumen blossom, frog, April or sardine. Ugh, sardine. <sighs> Sorry. What makes salmon meat red? Tissue pigment, blood pigment, sulfur, uh, shellfish pigment, or none of the above? That would be shellfish pigment. Finally. And I got it all right. Yay! <sighs> it's finally over. Hey, about question eight. I pulled an all-nighter last night. So I'm ready to collapse any second now. I'm gonna head home. See you later. Oh, that was pretty simplistic. Alright, now we're gonna hang out with Konishi-san. Who should be down here, I think he is. I know, he's in town. <sighs> Alrighty. Where the fuck is he? Is he in the kids? There he is, way in the back. So. Spend time with him. Now, if I remember correctly, I'm one behind on him. Then Masaya, Masaya <laughs> made up an excuse for why he was late. He said the wind was really strong. The teacher got really pissed. Shut your eyes, all of you. He yelled and started scolding us. Shut your eyes, all of you? What? But no one knew why he had to, we had to close our eyes, so it was really awkward. Yeah, it's kind of awkward. After scolding us, he started cl he starts class and yells out, "Who wants to answer?" I know, Masaya, answer the question. And Mas Masaya says, "I can't see the board. My eyes closed." <laughs> Teacher lost it right there, and the class became a free period. Smart ass kid. All right. Okay. I was right, we're one behind on where we should be with him. But that's because we need to get, um, Ayane-chan 
done. Uh, ask him to tell another story, tell your own tale of failure, or tell an American joke. I think the common consensus is with uh, most Japanese people, but I'm not so sure on this. But uh, American jokes are supposed to be somewhat vulgar. Not have such sure on that. Let's ask him another story. Something else? Okay, here's something that happened recently. I slipped off the road, fell into rice pot, uh, rice fields, and left a perfect imprint in the rice plants. The next day, the owner was complaining about someone damaging his fields and went looking for the culprit. He started calling out all the kids in the neighborhood and making them lay down in the imprint. Like Cinderella. No, the arm's too short, his head's too big, and on and on. <laughs> I went over to apologize to him, but when I did, I started cracking up, and he got so ticked. I bet. <laughs> I feel like it's been a while since I laughed. Oh no. A child, remember the liquor stores? Konishi san's son, right? The daughter was killed. Poor thing. A psychic on TV said their ancestors committed some sin. Ugh. I heard the store faces the northeast, and that's what's bringing all, in all the bad luck. Ah, feng shui. But the boy looks so cheerful, you'd figure he'd be sad. That's pretty cold of him. Motherfucker. Siblings close in age aren't that friendly to each other. My son and daughter are... <laughs> Great rumors. So you can choose either I'll go tell them off or you're not saying anything. I'll go tell them off. No, it's okay. They're <laughs> not worth your time. Those roving eyes mm -hmm. are always around somewhere. I'm used to it though. It seems they're not satisfied unless I look the, look like a victim. That's why it's been so long since I've talked to anyone about stupid things and just laughed. It's fun. Aww. What can you just tell me? I'm sorry. I probably made you feel uneasy, huh? Let's go home. I'll see you. That's so bad for the kid. Jeez. Let him get back to his normal life. I'll protect you all from the madness of this world. I'll take you to a place where you can be at peace. Yes, it's much more peaceful than here. Rescue anymore. Is this a warning? No punctuation or capitalization. What a cliche. Ain't this just a prank? The kind of stuff that only happens in the movies? Did you show this to your uncle? Senpai, Dojima san is trustworthy. But it may be best to keep this to ourselves. 
He will ask why you received such a letter. And if he were to put you under surveillance, our hands would be tied. If this letter is real, what's most important isn't what it says. It's the fact that it was delivered to the Dojima residence, addressed directly to you. This means the culprit knows in great detail who has been interfering with his crimes. And of all of us, he chose to deliver his message to the Dojima residence, home of a police detective. I'd have this letter checked at a crime lab if I could, but even then I doubt they'd find anything. The text is a warning, while the subtext expresses the culprit's confidence that we can't use it to pinpoint his identity. So it's useless to tell the police. In fact, that would make things worse. Cross your fingers, it's just a prank. I think the chances of that are slim. This message is too specific, too perfect to be a prank. But how could the killer know so much about us? Could he be watching us from somewhere? Teddy's been saying for a while that when we're over there, he senses someone watching us. Wait. Every time we went to the other side to rescue someone, did we end up on the Midnight Channel ourselves? I don't know. It, it seems like no one else knows what we're doing. I haven't heard any rumors about us at school. Even the people who I know checked the channel haven't said anything. The only gossip I heard was about the people who disappeared. I see. Come to think of it, how the Midnight Channel works is still a mystery. Let's put aside for now the matter of what that world truly is. There's too little data to go on. For now, we need to keep in mind that the culprit knows who we are. As long as we're all aware of that, it will be enough for now. Yeah, guess there's no use thinking about stuff we can't understand. Freaking out over speculation is just what the killer wants us to do, right? Yeah. All right. Mind if I change the subject then? The culture festival's just around the corner. What's our class doing again? Oh yeah, it hasn't been decided yet, huh? I heard we'll be voting on it soon. But aren't they still gathering ideas? Whoa, I think Yosuke just got hit with a bolt of inspiration. Whatever it is, it'll be out there. I bet my lunch on it. Hey, Senpai. Have you decided who you'll be going around the campus with during the festival? My schedule's still wide open, you lucky guy. Ugh, she just had to say something. Oh, we say son. Alrighty. Let's see here. We are going to the... In town. <laughs> uh, Shopping District North. We're going to talk to someone. Gonna, I think we're going to start working on... Um, Activating the uh, switching with uh, Shiragane san. Let me go to the north end. Yep, you. Done. Now we're going to hang out with um. I can't remember her name. Damn it, Tempest Arcana. What's her name? Ebby? No. Well, yeah, Ebby son. I think that was her name. Take this feather vacuum. Vacuum. Feather chop. This is such a move. Yeah, there is. I saw it. No, Yuta. You're liar. You couldn't lie again. Liar, liar, put the fire. I'll tell the teacher on you. Poor kid.
no camp for Utah, so you decided to walk him partway home. Really? Uh Feather the vacuum. Vacuum. I've never seen Feather Ranger. Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. That's that's a mouth tongue tie, you know? Sorry, hold on. Just wanna make sure I'm at the uh, right spot with this. Uh, why not? She's always watching TV. Have you asked to watch it? No, I can't. If I do that, she'll hate me. I'm sorry I'm late. Well, just you to not me. Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. I don't care. Eddie, that's her name. Eddie's not. I'll make it up to you. Is there anything you want? I'll buy it for you. Anything at all, just tell me what it is. Huh? <laughs> Look for that side. So how about a soccer ball? Okay, you don't want one? Mm. What about a samurai sword? When I was young, I used to... No. I don't want anything. I'm going home. Ugh, that kid. Ejected? Again. <laughs> Things don't ever seem to go my way. I don't know what a child wants. Featherman R. Oh, I think I saw a commercial for that on TV. It's a children's show, right? Is that so? I think it's on during one of the shows I usually watch. Featherman Ranger, or Ra Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Damn. Well then, I think I'll buy him a Featherman R toy or something. It's like I'm running brownie points. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Level six. Damn. Then I'll see you again. Yep. Damn, 10,000 yen. Nice. Welcome back. Thank you, Nanako chan. And we're leaving. You can stop cleaning here. We're going to be needing this room, so can uh, can you get all of your cleaning supplies out of here? Hold on. I'm uh one's one behind on this one, so I really need to keep track of this. All right. Uh, is there an emergency? Uh, we had a son. One of the nurses just collapsed. Ooh. She used to rest, but the doctors are br on break are using the lounge, so... She seems like overworked. Uh, don't tell anyone I said that, okay? I'd rather not get hauled in for a review. Here, help me. <sighs> she didn't have to do that. She just got a little wobbly. It's important to rest. And what if there's no time to rest? There's always work waiting for me. Then you make time for it. I'm lucky they didn't tie me down with an IV. I'm alright now. I'll be going. Kill myself. Huh? Shut up. I mean, I might be able to save someone's life. I need to do what I can. I can't spend time worrying about myself. Otherwise, I'd never be able to face him again. Would he want that? Of course he would. Wouldn't he? Oh, I see. I, I was doing it for myself. 
I wanted to escape the pain. I was working hard to avoid feeling anything at all. I see that now. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> I get it. Yeah, I get it. Thank you. You're welcome. Ah. Uh. rest for a little while longer. You can go now. Don't look at me. Hmm, not bad. Not great, but not bad. Hi. Saturday and Sunday next week. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, the cultural festival. I remember that. <clears throat> it's going to be interesting. Well, as you all know, next week is the culture festival. And as you also know, we still haven't decided what our class is going to do for it. <sighs> you guys don't care, do you? We are going to decide based on the suggestions we have so far. Please vote for one of them. Here they are. Break area, video room, and study room. Wow. Sounds like whatever we pick, we don't need to put any effort into it. Talk about lack of motivation. Yeah, but the easier the better, right? Oh, one more. Um, group date cafe. Hey, who put in a suggestion like that? Was it you, Chie? Yeah, right. Why would I do such a thing? What's a group date cafe? Who knows, but I doubt anyone will vote for it. Our class is actually a pretty serious bunch. Yeah, it's just a joke idea. You gotta have one weird one mixed in, you know? Ugh, figures! We'll be passing around the vote sheet. Just circle one of the suggestions. All right, time to count the votes. Uh, the first vote is group date cafe. Second vote, group date cafe. Huh? Seriously? Third vote, video room. Fourth vote, group date cafe. Group date cafe, group date cafe, study room, group date cafe. What are we gonna do? Don't ask me! This is your fault! I do wonder, though, do all those people who voted for it realize they have to run it themselves? I've never been on a group date before, so I was a little curious. What the? You voted for it? Yeah. I thought it would be sad if no one voted for it. But Yosuke's the one behind it. Hey, it wasn't just me. It came in first place. The public agrees. Well, since the majority rules, we'll be doing the group date cafe. But what does that even mean? Is it like speed dating? Can we really pull this off? You'd all better pitch in on this. Actually, would the teachers be okay with this? Dude. How could Kashiwagi say no? Miss Kashiwagi's busy getting ready for those two notorious pageants. That's why she's leaving it up to us students to decide what to do. Yeah, right. She just dumped it in our laps because she didn't want to bother. Group date cafe? Are we going to get any customers with this? Seriously, what is a group date cafe? I voted for it and I didn't even know. How the heck's this gonna turn out?
It doesn't matter what you pick. You're going to get the group date cafe anyway, so. All right, chance for a second. We are going to talk to Shiragane san. Custom first belt, first floor. Apologize, I wanted to talk someplace quiet. What sort of person gave this to you? Doesn't really matter, we're initiating the social link, so. Man of black sunglasses. Sunglasses. Hmm. Wheels in town like this would only make him stick out. Uh, <clears throat> what we can take from that is that he wanted to hide his face at any cost. The man must also know you well. Uh, know you well. He wouldn't have entrusted the delivery to anyone he didn't know. But this is a small town. He could easily have looked up my address. Well, I go to the trouble of giving the letter to you. Intriguing. Is he involved with this case, or another case altogether? If it's me he's after, he could be anyone. Oh, well, I'll keep the card. The man is most likely here in Inaba. I can't drag you further into this. Let's go home together. Huh? Are you worried about me? I apologize. I'm sorry. I seem to have a tin ear for other people's feelings. Yosuke-san <laughs> told me uh, so before. I look into this card to report my findings to you, so don't worry about me. As a leader, I know you have a lot on your shoulders, so... Yay! Thou I thy am thou, thou stubbed to new bond, brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed and craved personas of the Fortune Arcana. Woo! My uh, personal favorite persona is actually the ultimate of this Arcana. Well, my personal favorite of this game. Over here, why don't we chat a little? Oh yeah, something I wanted to ask you. Alright. Shall we Oh welcome home, big bro. Thank you, Nanako chan. Goodbye, Nanako chan. Alright, we are tutoring tonight, right? Yes. I see the word that was omitted, so it was really saying. To tell you the truth, I'm not that good with the English language. I can memorize what's in the textbooks and get good grades on tests, but I don't really understand it. But the teacher doesn't comprehend the difference between reading from textbooks and speaking to people. Teaching must be a great job, even idiots can be arrogant when they know more than you do. They don't get what it means to learn at all. Um, give me a second, sorry. For those that don't know, I'm planning on being a teacher. I'm actually studying to teach English in Japan. Fuck you, kid. Alright, so we want to give, um, that's just how it is. <laughs> a student's value is equal to how well he scores on tests. Well, at least that's easy to understand. About the transfer student I told you about before. His grades are pretty good, but he can't beat me. So then, the rest of the class and the teacher make this face like the transfer student is no good after all. Looking down him. Aww. And yet, he acts all big, so everyone hates him. Literally, no one even talks to him. It's also stupid. Why do I have to go to a school when it's so obviously dumb? That place... 
You gonna click this one? Uh, you're not only, you're not the only one. Oh, I see. Everyone goes to school against their will. Yeah, technically. That's gonna be high. Looks fun. At least I get that feeling when I see you. Oh, but by the time I'm a first year, you'll you'll ha uh, already have graduated. <laughs> then there's no point, huh? Also, one point behind him. Damn. Well, we have plenty of time to make that up. Oh, time's up. Be careful going home. Please come back again. Of course. Your mom's paying me to.